You have five benches installed around downtown Melbourne for visitors and shoppers more than a decade ago are no longer there. We're talking about the benches along East New Haven Avenue. New 6's James Barbero explains why they have disappeared. So if you've walked around downtown Melbourne since December, maybe you've noticed there aren't any benches on the sidewalk anymore. The city put in the old benches like this one back in 2012. Now they're gone and the homeless are being blamed. There was a lot of loitering that was happening on the benches, a lot of trash. It's Kim Agee's job to bring people downtown, and now Melbourne Main Street says businesses and their customers are much happier that the homeless aren't sitting on the benches for hours each day and sleeping on them at night. It's been very positive. Obviously, we want benches downtown. We want to have places for the community to be able to sit and relax and visit with one another. But that wasn't happening. That wasn't available to them. Yes, I'm totally for uh, the removal of the benches. Vice Mayor Yvonne Minus made some of the same points that Kim talked to me about. There were many issues taking over the benches where the residents or, or the business customers could not find anywhere to sit. If someone were to see this story and think, this is taking it too far, perhaps. Just give them a place to sit. What would you say to them? Well, they have plenty of places to sit and enjoy themselves. They're in our parks. They're along all different areas throughout our community. We're just trying to make sure that the businesses' interests are also protected. Would you ever like to see benches come back downtown? Definitely. I am in total support of helping our homeless. But it has to be conducive also to our business owners. The city continues to say its long-term plan to help homelessness will be building an affordable housing community called Providence Place. It would replace this soup kitchen and shelter the Daily Bread, which is walking distance from downtown. In Melbourne, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news six.